Welcome folks to another Unreal tutorial. In this video we're going to be exploring teleportation. It shouldn't take too long to do, but so without further ado, I'm going to just come into this um, level here. So you can see I've got a doorway here and a doorway here. So this doorway here on the right is going to be our return. This doorway on the left is going to be our exit. And through this exit, we're going to go on to another level. So let's have a look. So you can see here, before going back through into the other level, uh, we've got our main level down there. We're very, very high up. And what I've done is created another doorway here. So as we go through, it brings us back through into the level. So without further ado, let's see how I created this. So you'll need to create a new level, third person uh, uh, player. It's going to bring up now the uh, blueprints that I created for this. So it's, it's actually quite simple. We've got uh, an exit and also we've got a return. So basically this box here is connected to the trigger box where we enter. You then create a teleportation from that. You link that to where your destination is going to be, which is just an empty actor. You have to kind of create a get actor location. And then the target here is the player. So basically, it's only the player that can activate the, um, the exit. And then basically, what we do is we copy that pretty much. Uh, we'll delete that and delete that because they flip around. So with this, this will be for our return through the doorway and this will be um, the uh, the location that we'll be uh, arriving at in the level so what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm not going to destroy them I'm going to create another set so it's going to go back through here so what you'll need to do is you'll need to create, first of all, it doesn't have to be a doorway, just something uh, you can sort of find the location, but I would say, you know, just use a doorway. So I'm gonna go through to starter content, props, and SM door frame, let's drag that in there. We'll put that, say, somewhere like that. Hit F, just to get the location. So we've got that there. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to go to Volumes and we're going to create a trigger volume. I'm going to drag that over the uh, doorway there. Oops, I don't know what happened there. Let's try that again. Okay. We'll drag that over and just take a bit of time just to something like that there we go so we've got the exit we need to create the destination but we'll come to that in a minute once you've got this set up we go through to so basically what you'll need to do is you'll need to go to blueprints and open level blueprint that'll take you through to here and what you do is let's just move that to one side you're going to right click you're going to go to where it says add event for trigger volume you're going to click on that and then click again on that arrow there and add on actor begin overlap so you end up with a box like this click off the executable button and then we're going to type in teleport like so now we need to create our destination. So this is where we're going to go to the level. So I'm just going to um, I think it's this one. There we go. So we've got our other level here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a another door frame. So go through to SM door frame we'll drag it in say there and then what we're going to do is click on basic go all the way to the top and then drag in empty actor 
I'm going to put that somewhere around about there. Now if it helps, give it a name. At the moment it's just called Actor. We'll call this... Arrive underscore Actor 2. I've already got one. So we know where our destination is going to be. I'll come back up to here. Now with that selected, I'm going to then right click and then it says here create a reference to arrive at two so we'll do that but we can't connect it up just yet as you'll see here we need to create a get actor location so I'm going to click off that actor location and then we can connect that up to there and then lastly, for this stage, click off target and we'll go get player character. Like so. Okay, let's have a look and see if it works. Hit compile. And I'm going to go to where it says play. Hit F11. Right, so I'm not going to go through my other doorways. I'm going to go through this doorway here. There we go. So we're through to the level, which is great. However, I can't get off. Okay, so we need to create our exit or our return. So I'm going to hit F11. So this is where we need to basically highlight all of your uh, your script. I'm going to right click and if you don't have it showing there, you want to create comment uh, from selection. You can type it in there. I'm going to call this uh, exit, okay, just so we don't get mixed up. Now for the next part, what we can do is we can actually copy this and we'll just delete um, some of the other notes. So we're going to go there, Control C and then Control V. Now I'm just going to get rid of that one there. So we're just going to leave these two because these uh, this one here and this one here we're going to need to change. So I'm going to move these down. Right, so for the return, I'm going to go back to our level. got our doorway there so for the return I'm gonna put another doorway there so I'll move that out of the way drag our doorway in to say something like that and I'm going to drag in the empty actor like so and I'm gonna call this Actor return two. And back on our other platform here, we need to create a little doorway. So, what we'll do is Drag another doorway, say there, and this time again, like uh, before, we go to volumes and go and find our trigger volume. Drag that on there, like so. I'm going to hit F, and then you can scale it just so you're not triggering it immediately. So something like that.
like so. So with that selected, I'm going to go back to the um, the level bl blueprint. I'm going to left click, go to Add Event Collision, and Add On Actor Begin Overlap. So like before, but this time it's going to connect to the other doorway. So I'm zoom in a little bit there. Connect that up. And then for the actor, we're going to need to just go down. So if you recall, I renamed it. Uh, it was uh, Arrive Actor 2, which is there. Uh, sorry, Return. Actor Return. Right click and then Create Reference to Actor Return 2. And then click, drag that into there. Like so. Highlight all of these, right click, and then uh, set before, just type in comment, add comment, and we'll call this return. Now, this isn't vital for the um, for the visual scripting, it's just you know housekeeping really, just to kind of make sure that you've got everything in order. So there we go. So we've got our exit and our return there. And you can just move that around. So Click Compile. All right, the moment of truth. Let's go through to play and hit F11. Actually, I'll just minimize that there. There we go. And let's try that again. Right, so that's our return doorway over there. We don't want to go through that. We're going to go through this first. So we'll go through there. There we go. So we come through that doorway, that's all looking good. And then we've got our return doorway, which is here. Okay, there we are. So that's it folks. Hopefully you found this uh, tutorial useful. Got any questions, of course, um, get in touch. If you're watching this on YouTube, please hit me with a like, a comment and a subscribe if you like and uh, and that's it so until next time folks thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video okay bye for now